I'd like to tell you about an amazing young man. His name is Kuhao, and he's my friend. Kuhao's name actually means extraordinary gift in Hawaiian. What makes Kuhao's talent even more amazing is the fact that he's self-taught. It's inspirational, especially when you consider he does it all without his sight. Kuhao is blind. Everybody has a gift and if we share it, you know, I think that sooner or later somebody's gonna be touched. I thought of Andy as a, a special friend. What we should be doing with this gift is to continue to use it wisely, to share it with people no matter where we go or whoever we see. It's easy to recognize his gift because very few people in the world that are blind can play the piano as well as he can. Music can set people's mind free, bless people, and it makes people feel happy. One of the amazing things that Kuhao can do is he can listen to any piece of music once or twice, and then he can sit down on the piano and play it. Like a couple of times listening to the song just goes in my brain. And then when that is finished, I get on the piano, and then I just play it. The first time that I saw Kuhao do what he does, there's no words that can really express what I felt. Right away, I knew I had to grab my video camera and videotape him, and so I took that video and uploaded it to YouTube because I wanted to share it with a few friends, and it went viral, and I think that original video has over 700,000 views. We started his own YouTube channel, and you know, he's uploading music, and people from all over the world, people he doesn't even know, are just stunned too about what he can do, and just his music is touching other people's lives. It's crazy. I love music because it inspires people. Everybody who has their own gifts should learn to share as well. I visited Kuhao's church with him. It's amazing, you know, before the meeting starts, people show up early just to hear him play. I've been there when other people are visiting, you know, tears are rolling down their, their face and they're definitely touched. So what I've been doing with my gift is to just continue to bless the lives of others and to share it with people. So what makes this even more amazing is the fact that Kuhao discovered this gift when he was 12 and he didn't even have his own piano. It was at his grandparents' house when he would go to their house, you know, a couple times a week, he'd jump on the piano and, and he taught himself how to play. I have no idea why I was blessed to come across or meet paths with Kuhao. It's been a blessing in my life and I know it's been a blessing in his too. Kuhao is such an example to all of us. If I've learned one thing, it's not hiding in these gifts, it's, it's sharing more. It's about blessing other people's lives. Heavenly Father first gave me this gift because He loves me, He wants to bless me more, and that He would someday want me to be like Him. We can follow and accomplish our dreams in life. Anything is possible. God knows our gifts. My challenge to you is to pray, to know the gifts we have been given, to know how to develop them and to recognize the opportunities to serve others that God provides us.